Prayer for Healing Father, I thank you for your Son, Jesus Christ, whom you have given the authority to reconcile us back to you. I confess my sins before you, Lord, and I ask for forgiveness and mercy in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ. Today, Lord, I come before you seeking healing and deliverance from the spirit of infirmity. I know that true healing comes through your Son, Jesus Christ. In fact, you said that Jesus was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for iniquity. The chastisement for our peace was upon him, and by his stripes we are healed. That's Isaiah 53, 5. Lord, I claim what Jesus has done for me and everyone who believes. I believe that I am healed of all sickness and disease because of the stripes Jesus bore for me. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. You further stated that the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. That's John 1, verse 1, and verse 14. Father, I am aware that the Word made flesh was indeed your Son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Therefore, I understand when you said that you sent forth your Word and healed them and delivered them from their destruction. Psalm 107, verse 20. It is clear that the Word was Jesus, Christ of Nazareth, made flesh. Again, 1 John 5 verse 7 says that there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Ghost. Revelation 19 verse 13 says, And he, Jesus Christ, was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood, and his name is called the Word of God. Father God, not only am I convinced that your Son and my Savior Jesus Christ of Nazareth is my healer, which is your word, but I also bind myself to your word as I declare scriptures of healing. The word says, according to my faith, be it unto me, and that I cannot please you without my faith. That's Matthew 9 verse 29 and Hebrews 11 verse 6. I decree, declare, and engage the following spiritual laws of healing. He has sent his word to heal me. That's Psalm 107, verse 20. He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds. That's Psalm 147, verse 3. Because of his stripes, I am healed. That's Isaiah 53, 5. Healing is the children's bread. That's Matthew 15, verse 26. The Lord will sustain me on my sickbed. During my illness, he will restore me to full health. Psalm 41, verse 3. Heal me, O Lord, and I shall be healed. That's Jeremiah 17, verse 14. Confess your faults one to another and pray one for another, that you may be healed. The effectual fervent prayer of a righteous avail, availeth much. That's James 5, verses 14 to 16. For I will restore health unto thee, and I will heal thee of thy wounds, says the Lord. That's Jeremiah 30, verse 17. And you shall serve the Lord thy God, and he shall bless thy bread and thy water. And I will take away sickness away from the midst of thee. That's Exodus 23, verse 25. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and do not forget his benefits, who forgives all iniquities, who heals all your diseases. Psalm 103, verses 2 to 3. O Lord, by these things men live. And in all these is the life of my spirit. Restore me to health and let me live. That's Isaiah 38 verse 16. A merry heart does good like medicine. That's Proverbs 17 verse 22. So Father, I claim, believe, and receive these promises in the name of Jesus Christ. Your word says all things are possible to those who believe. That's Mark 9 verse 23. My son, give attention to my words, incline your ears to my sayings. Do not let them depart from your eyes, keep them in the midst of your heart, for they are life to those who find them and health to all their flesh. That's Proverbs 4 verses 20 to 22. He gives power to the weak and to those who have no might, he increases their strength. Those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall not run, 
They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Isaiah 40, verses 29 to 31. Amen.